Welcome to the tutorial series on TIBCO. In this session, I brief about JMS palettes in TIBCO. You can visit my blog post, the link is given in the video description below. In this post, I explain the steps in detail. Before developing the TIBCO process, I would create a JMS connection and JMS properties from the resources option as shown. Make sure EMS server is running. Now, let's create a process to send a text message to the queue by using JMSQ Sender. Create TIBCO process and bring in JMSQ Sender then configure the JMS connection and destination key properties. Set the message body in the queue sender and using write to log activity log the message ID from the JMS sender activity. Run the process to send push a message to Q. Now, let's create another process by using JMSQ Receiver Starter Activity. Drag and drop JMSQ Receiver and Log Activity then configure JMS Connection and Destination Key Properties for the Receiver.
finally log the message body in the log activity as shown. Run the receiver process alone to fetch and process the message from the queue. Test the project and verify the behavior by rerunning both the sender and receiver processes as shown. Instead of queue sender, we would use JMS queue requester activity from JMS palette. In queue receiver process, using reply to JMS message activity, we reply to the queue. Let's test the processes and verify the behavior. Thanks for watching the video. Subscribe to the channel. Thanks once again.